little spoon people. So I have my little spoon. And I've cut out some little clothes. I'm gonna start with drawing his little face on. Well, we'll start with googly eyes. So. Okay, so we're gonna take our little googly eyes and then I'm gonna use a hot glue gun, but you can use regular glue. And I'm just gonna put these on the back of the little spoon. And then I feel like this is a little fun craft that anybody could do. I'm only using like little velvet paper, looks like this. And then I'm just using spoons, yarn, some pipe cleaners, and a whole bunch of little wiggly eyes. So I have my little eyes on there. Um, now he needs a nose and a smile. Can cut out. You guys can make a dress, a shirt, pants, overalls, however you want your little people to be. I'm gonna do a dress for this one. And then I'm just gonna make it a little smaller so it's easier to cut. Okay. Okay, we're gonna keep cutting. And you guys can do whatever color paper you want whatever style you want. I'm just gonna do a green little dress like that. And I'm just gonna add some glue to the back. And I'm gonna add my little spoon. Here's our spoon. What is he missing? Looks like he's missing, she's missing some hair. I'm gonna use this as the hair. And you can use as little or as much as you want. And I'm just gonna cut them all about the same length. Okay, I'm gonna use a few pieces, probably about four or five. One more. And I'm gonna add this to my little spoon person. Just gonna do a little dot of glue at the top. And here's one of our little people. She's kind of cute. Uh, let's see, is she missing anything? <laughs> Did you look in his lunch pail? Yeah. And I think we have time for one more. So I have some little pants and a shirt cut out. And then I'm gonna glue on some googly eyes. Make the pants a little bit smaller. So I'm just gonna add my glue where I want the eyes. And then I'm gonna stick the eyes on the glue like that. And then we can add his clothes. So we'll just do glue to the back of the spoon. Hot. And then we'll add the shirt. 
Little stragglers. And then I forgot to give them arms. So we'll take a part pointer and we'll just cut it in half. And then we'll roll up the ends a little bit. So they kind of look like hands. And then we'll glue that also. So for this project, you really just need a either regular glue. I'm using a hot glue gun for convenience. Then you could just make little spoon people. So there's his arms now. And they're movable. Just gotta give him a smile and he needs some hair. So. Let's see if I can draw him a little smile. I don't think I can do it backwards, but I'll show you guys when I'm done. I'm go right down. And I am not the artiste. So, there's his little smile. Kind of cheesy. And then I'm gonna take some more yarn and I'm gonna give him a little hair. We're gonna do some little short hairs. Okay. Do a couple more. And everything is up to you. So if you want your little spoon person to be bald, he can be bald, or you can have a full head of hair. We're gonna do about this much. I'm just gonna add some glue to the end, stick them all together. And then I'm gonna add them to my spoon person. Like so. And then you can play with it. This hair is a little weird. Whoa. And there we have our little easy art. Oopsie. Our little easy arts and crafts project. And I think I only needed one, two, three materials, three or four. Spoons, velvet paper. I used some yarn, some hot glue, and I did googly eyes. And then it's a little wonky, but it's okay. And that is all I have for you guys today.